Hi guys, I'm Vazby here, and today guys I am reviewing, uh, not reviewing, sorry, showcasing or showing you my LEGO, uh, animal collection as of, on uh, November 7th, no, sorry, let me try to pronounce this again, November 7th, 2000, November, let me try this again, November 7th, 2015, um, yeah guys, so I, if you don't know, already I collect LEGO animals, I like collecting them, so that's good, um, I have about 26, well, I should say LEGO creatures, I'm showcasing my LEGO creatures, but technically, by definition, these are all Lego animals. So, uh, according to the dictionary, an animal is anything that consumes organic matter. I don't believe humans are animals, though. But let's get rocking and rolling and see the different animals I have. Um, so I have a uh, hold on. Let me just make that brighter. Sorry about the lighting in here. See, I have black two black horses. So if you can get closer, I can't zoom in on because if sorry if the camera's shaky, guys. Um, I am recording on an iPad, so I apologize in advance. See, these horses with snails can move their feet, legs back. This can't, and this can't. Um, I'll show you the detail on this horse. If I can get the, if I can get the armor off, oh my gosh. So, um, I, I keep the armor on because I cannot find a certain brick that can, that is the same exact color, or the exact, that looks similar color to this green. I have two different type co colors of green, or three actually. But I just don't have one that actually is that shade of green, if you know. So that's a Native American horse or an Indian horse. Whatever you guys want to call it. Um, I prefer a Native American, but I was Indian is shorter than a horse second. Sorry, so I'm so, I apologize in advance, guys, if you can't see anything, guys. No wonder I can't do that. I'm putting on the horse armor backwards. Hmm. Yeah, guys, sorry if you can't see anything, because I'm recording on an iPad. So I don't have a tripod or anything like that, or anything to um help stabilize the iPad. But yeah. See my three German Shepherd dogs, and I don't buy uh no I don't buy Lego animals individually. I like to buy them in sets to be honest with you. But yeah, so now to move on to my snakes, I got these two snakes from um where I get them from. I got them from the Lego City Police Swamp uh, uh sets the not the Surfer Rescue what's it called um the it's the, it's the cheap it's the two cheapest sets the starter set. And another one, I don't remember what the name was, sorry about that, but um, anyways. So see right here, the Ninjago, uh, Ninjago Snake, I got this from the Lord of the Rings Gandalf Arrives set, I believe. I think that's what it is, a Ninjago Fireworks, but yeah. Yellow Crab, um, and then two mice. Sorry if this is boring, guys. If it is boring, guys, just turn it off, because I know this can be boring, but yeah. Um, a fish, a red spider, a black spider, hopefully you can see that, I'll try to zoom in a little better. Uh, I'm not zooming in, just move the camera forward. And an octopus, and this is the reason why I like collecting Lego animals, that I found that it, Lego an animals are interesting to collect. So when I got this octopus, at first I was trying to find certain sets that I could use good mock pieces for it. And I got this for $6.96 because I got it 4 cents cheaper. But anyways guys, um, I got the 4, four cents cheaper. But um, it was a good deal as far as the price, and it came with an octopus and a minifigure. Minifigure, sorry. Um, I, and I use the octopus, and I want to use the octopus for custom makes, but the reason why I like collecting Lego animals right now is because of the octopus, which I got not too long ago, like, less than a month ago. Not sure. But I do like collecting Lego animals, that's very, um, I do like uh, each individual Lego animal, Lego animal. So yeah, yeah guys. I just have anything else. <coughs> Sorry about that. I have an alligator. I'm going to right here. Um, as you see right here, the tail is connected by Lego Technic pieces, you know, and the tail can move back and forth because of Technic, Lego Technic half pin. So yeah, guys, that's that. And, um, a great white shark. And for gray sharks, um, I'd say, well, where'd you get all these sharks? Uh, I got them from all the Coast Guard sets. I actually own all the Coast Guard sets. No, I'm not going to review all the Coast Guard sets because it's a problem. I don't have all the pieces. They broke. Yeah. And, yeah. I'm not going to review all of them. I reviewed one of them. Actually, I'm, I reviewed two of them as of today. Anyways, guys, I just want to show you the difference between <coughs> that about the great white shark and the gray shark. If you know, so right here, if you know, um, here's the gray shark. The gray shark has no gills. The gray white great white shark has gills. Sorry about that. Um, but anyways, guys, the great white shark. It's called a great white shark, you might say. Well, what's that's not a great white shark, other than it's white. Well, it is a great white shark, because according to Lego.com, this is actually called a great white shark. 
the tail is a different shape as you see it here. Um, as you see the bottom is even different too still. It's right there. And I just wanted to show you well if let's say if you if you get a shark, at least one of the Sega sharks, right? From the Coast Guard, it says new. Guess what? If they're assembled like this, they're not new. Because if you say, oh, it's a shark that's never been built, guess what? These have been built. These these sharks actually, when they come, when you buy them new in the set, these sharks actually come, that actually have their faces off and look like this. Yes. But um, what's good about these, this part, is that they can make custom builds. Or not custom builds, custom sharks. A little, a little bit of customization, not too much. I personally like this one. It looks like a, uh, the shark has a mask. But this shark, yeah, it looks like a naked chicken. Or what I mean by that is a featherless chicken. Or dragon gas. It looks like a like a can you see can you see it? a skin of a chicken and then the f a little bit of feathers. That's what it reminds me of. But yeah, guys. Um, so that's that. Anything else? But yeah. Um, let me just redo that. Anything else? One second. Okay, and here's my dragon. Anything else? So guys, this is my dragon. Um, I got it from the Lego Castle theme or Knights theme. Not sure which one, which one it is. Dragon keeps wanting to fall. Here, guys, spikes, and it has its the wings are connected by Lego Technic. Yes, you know, tail. Let's see, and it did come with fire, but yeah, guys. I guess it's guys next time. Please comment, rate, subscribe if you have not. Uh, share this video with your family and friends, and whoever else you want to share this video with. Guess see you guys next time. Anna, well, bye bye.